It's funny because the very first thing I bought with my very first paycheck was a skateboard. But I didn't start learning until maybe four years later. Everything about starting to skate is scary. You don't want to look dumb, you don't want to fall. And it took me a while to even go to a skate park. I was really nervous and I thought I wasn't good enough to even go yet. But once I went, I started going almost every day. I would get off work and go straight to the park. I saw how much better everyone was, but I didn't care for once. I realized that the community I was in didn't care about that either. No matter what's going on at the skate park, we all have one thing in common, and that's that we all love skating. When people see you having fun or working hard towards any goal, they shouldn't judge you. They should root for you. And that's exactly what the skateboarding community is all about. I didn't notice it at the time, but I started to go out more. I was starting to talk to more people, and I was getting better at interacting with different kinds of people, which my anxiety made very hard to do at times. I realized that I was actually overcoming my anxiety with skateboarding. I was in a good place at the time. I was very happy, energetic, social, and of course, sweaty. <laughs> but everything was going well. However, after my first and very awful semester at community college, I decided to transfer and finish school at Full Sail, which meant I had to move to Florida. I had to adjust to everything all over again. I was alone again. I was antisocial again. I was anxious, and I fell back into my old patterns. The only thing that pulled me out of my head was my skateboard. It was always there, and I could always have it with me, so it made me feel better all the time. Skating really got me through some of my hardest days. Before skating, I didn't know how to make new friends, but now I do. Before skating, I'd worry about everything, and I had no outlet, but now I do. Now, I look at the world with a whole new perspective. I want to take that risk. I want to try new things. I want to learn from others. Skating allows you to be creative. It allows you to push yourself to the limit. When I'm on my board, I feel free. I don't have to think about anything except for the present moment. And that's what skating has taught me, to live in the moment, to push yourself, to appreciate this earth and nature, to appreciate your friends, to appreciate growth. Throughout this entire journey, I've been documenting my progress and uploading it to my YouTube channel. And to my surprise, people actually started watching, and my channel has been growing very rapidly ever since. And I'm just really thankful to be able to help people that are nervous to start skating like I was, and to help them get out of their comfort zone and try something new. Because of skateboarding, I've literally figured out who I am, and I've created this brand and persona called Trinspace. I've definitely still got a long journey to go, but I know for a fact that I wouldn't be who I am today if it wasn't for skateboarding. That was it. That was it? That was it. That was it? That was pretty good. Oh! <laughs>